Yeah, it's, uh, it's very shocking to see what's going on in the streets of Montreal. Citizens have a right to have their own security in their streets. It's one of the fundamental role of the state to make sure that we are safe in our streets. And unfortunately, it's not true anymore. The feeling that many Montrealers have currently is that it's becoming more and more unsafe. Uh, I, I do believe that the first thing that Mr. Legault needs to do uh, is to be here with the community, with Montrealers, listen to actors, listen to people who are scared right now, and share share their pain and make sure he hears what their solutions are. I think that's the first thing he needs to do. The second one is the police. Um, you know, the uh, municipal administration of Ms. Plante uh, has been saying for over a year now they will increase the number of policemen in the streets of Montreal. It's actually the opposite that happened. The uh, president uh, of the policemen yesterday, uh, three days ago said there was 72 less policemen in our streets. This is unacceptable. The Conservative Party of Quebec is proposing to increase the number of police by 400. Um, that's uh, one part of the solution. The other thing we're asking also is to make sure that uh, illegal guns, because this is what we're talking about, all the shootings that happen have all been done with illegal arms, and we do believe that we need to attack that uh, criminals need to have much more severe pains for such crimes. Uh, we, uh, you know, we've been talking for years and years about legal guns for hunters and, and farmers. Uh, they're not the problem right now. That's not what we need to handle as politicians. We need to look at illegal arms that are coming from uh, our borders or, or reserves, and we need to make sure that uh, the pain that uh, we're, they're, when we're sending them to jail, it's not just for one year when they're caught with 200 illegal guns. This makes no sense.